What's up, YouTube? So, my boy, he just sent me this video. Uh, you guys might know this guy, H3H3. H3. Uh, he's, he's a character. He's a funny guy, though. Um, so, he does. He did a video, apparently, uh, titled Prince EA Wants to Autocorrect Humanity. And I just wanted to watch it, you know. So, I figured, hey, let's do a reaction to his video talking about me. Let's see what it is. What's up, H3H3? H3? Uh, let's get into it. We used to goof on this guy, Prince Yep, <laughs> who made this video, like, uh, look, look up, up from your phone. It's super dramatic and corny. And I used to be like, you know, this guy, he's talking shit on phones, like, shut up. Just don't use your phone. And I yeah. used to blast this guy and say he's such a nerd. Used to blast him. <laughs> and I was like, wait, am I, like, what's the difference between me now? Because <laughs> I'm, I'm saying that I don't think social media is good for me. It really took us Was like he right? it took us like a couple of days. We were like, wait, were we making fun of him? And now we're like the <laughs> yeah. victims. I need to reassess that <laughs> because I still feel okay. like the correlation is not exact. Yeah, I don't know if I'm in denial. <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, let's yeah. watch the video because let, let me refresh some of you guys' yeah, memory. This is what we're video. talking about here. Let me pull this up. Did you know the average person spends four years of his life? So let's press pause real quick. So it's funny. I did this video. Three years ago, uh, I wonder why he's talking about it now. I think he did a parody video on this video a while ago, but I wonder why he's why he's bringing it up now. Interesting. Maybe maybe he's gonna explain why. Let's all right. Let's go back to it. It's Kinda like where'd you get that? I don't know. I read the bad. It's like all right, man. All right, I'm just gonna let it play. I'm gonna let you guys watch this. It's hard for me not. Like I agree with him kind of. I think now, but let's watch the video. But it's the way he does it. Like the did you emotional know, music. Did you know? That an average person spends four years. <laughs> this video came out like four. Well, you know, it's it's. I just paused it. It's uh, it's art. You know, it's spoken word poetry. You know, it's designed to be emotional, right? Human beings, uh, we're not logical creatures. We're emotional beings. So if we want to move somebody in a direction, you gotta, you gotta reach. You gotta tap into, tap into the heart. You know. But let's keep let's keep watching and see what he's got to say. Four years ago, I mean, people were only using social media heavily for like four years. It wasn't as bad as it is today when he made the video. So was he but a what, prophet? Yeah, was he ahead of his time? Right. <laughs> <laughs> prophet. I don't think so. This guy's a clown. I will never give him credit. But let, let's be honest about it. Let's watch. Ironic, ain't it? Ironic, ain't it? These touch screens can make us. Like this is the shit. <laughs> see what he's doing is like. <laughs> Well, <laughs> what he's doing is like, <laughs> when, uh, <laughs> so I don't believe that. I think what I'm talking is about is like somebody on a toilet taking a shit but on Twitter. When, when we go to dinner or anyone today goes to dinner, do you not open your phone? But is that a problem between relationships? Like she's there like, seriously, dude, I just want to live my life. I guess, I guess that's, that's a problem that he taught. Like the problem is with the relationship. The problem is with yourself. Everybody, everybody's mm. doing it. You don't have a problem. No, I don't Everybody's have, doing it. Right. It's the mm. problem you and yourself. Yeah, the problem is, I just paused it up. The problem is always between you and yourself, whether it's uh, you're distracted on a phone or whether you're distracted by the thoughts in your mind, if the the point of the video was to be present, right? To to be connected with a person, uh, and have that have priority over being connected to the nearest Wi-Fi, right? When you're in the presence of another person, let's keep going. He was speaking. The problem with his video, I'm not. I just got to flood a play for you guys. Yeah, but let me just say this. <laughs> I think the problem with this video is that he's speaking to this, like, these enlightened few who are like, I see the problem. I have a flip phone. I only <laughs> use Nokia's from 1993. I'm enlightened, like, all, unlike all my plebeian scumbag friends who use <laughs> iPhones, f***ing <laughs> peasant <laughs> suckers. I'm, Which, I'm on a higher plane of existence. It's funny because we used to kind of be like that for a while. Like, we didn't have a smartphone when everyone else did, remember? Mm -hmm. For a for the longest time, I was we on were a like, higher plane of existence. Why nope. do you think our videos were better back then? <laughs> but think eventually, you got to get that smartphone. <laughs> I think it's the coming from that place of like authority of like, we know, we are enlightened, and we see the problem with the world. They don't. They are the problem. It's like I, the it's like the vegans who give vegan. Yeah. Um. So. It's not that I um, 
I never want to come across as enlightened or that I know it all. You know, I did that video because I was having the issue, right, with the smartphones. <laughs> you know, I'm always on it. I'm in the presence of, you know, whether it's, uh, you know, a friend or, you know, my family. I'm I'm looking on it, right? So this is a this is a personal experience, uh, which is why I made the video. You know, who who better to speak on a subject than somebody who has um, spent a bunch of time on on social media in the past, excessive amounts. Let's keep it going. Give vegans bad rap because right. they're like right. preachy about it. Yeah, you need to look up. Like we were at we were actually at a restaurant this week, which rather outside sitting. And a lady came to me and she was like, you're eating here? And I'm like, yeah, you're eating right <laughs> I now. I remember that. And she was like, you know you shouldn't. Like, there's no difference between what you're eating and, and like, she pointed at Shredder. Yeah. And it's like, you know, you make, maybe you're making a good point, but, like, why? I don't know. <laughs> I Leave it. me alone. The reluctance of being like, <laughs> that's fine point. But at the same time, do you do this to everybody you see with the dog? Who's eating and a sandwich? And I can approach a conversation with you. Like, I'm trying to have a lunch right now. Bitch, I'm trying to live my life. Can you <laughs> fucking move on, please? I, but the thing that you don't understand is that she's on a higher plane of, of enlightenment. Okay? Like, you can't possibly understand the vast intellect that her and this guy, they looking down from, like, Mount Olympus. And you can't possibly understand. Did you know that, <laughs> that people waste four years of their life on their phones, Hilo? <laughs> By the time someone's seven years old, they've wasted six years of their life on their phone. I think he said four Do hours. Do the math. No. <laughs> Not four hours, he said four years. Four years. <laughs> oh, mate. Wait, let's... Well, four <laughs> hours isn't that drastic. I no, he definitely said Wait, he said years? Yeah. That's what I was doubtful. Oh, yeah, four for. years. Did That's... you know Did you know that when somebody turns five, they've already wasted four years of their life on their phone, Ela? That's pretty rough. It will shock you. <laughs> but if only they could ascend to godlike enlightenment they would understand <laughs> if only they could flip their collar like me prince <laughs> ie it's the collar pop you can't get on here on your soapbox and expect me to not to take you seriously yeah. with the, the collar the collar pop that's the that's the kanye west that's the early early yay you know the collar the collar it's like your shirt you know you're, you're uh you know i i can i can take you seriously even though you have a tie-dye shirt on with skulls on it you know, it ain't, it ain't about that. You know, it's about what you, what you saying. What's what's your message? Kind of ironic, ain't it? Why are you doing this? <laughs> like, what are you doing? What do you? What do you? It was cold. We're by the pier. I'm a little chilly. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm a little. I'm a little cold. You know, feel me that it wasn't exactly. Uh, you know, 90 degree weather by the pier. It was like you know sunset. So. It was a little, little chilly, my friend. He's just, he's just so <laughs> stoked with all the beautiful thoughts he's having right now. <laughs> kind of ironic, isn't it? Like, just, just, I don't know, man. All right. Can we auto-correct humanity, by the way? All right. I just need to let this play. I'm getting too riled up. Just let yeah, it play. calm down, man. Calm, calm, calm down. Here we go, Prince Harry. Simmer down a little bit. Yay. How these touch screens can make us lose, lose touch. touch. See, I didn't... But it's no wonder in a world filled with iMacs, iPads, and iPhones. So many eyes, so many selfies, not enough us's and we see. Technology has made us more selfish and separate than ever. Cause while it claims to connect us, connection has gotten no better. Brandon Sloan. I don't know that that's the argument, right? Mm -hmm. He's talking about like, oh, we're yeah. disconnected. Social media, but I, I actually yeah. disagree with that. I think people are more connected. That's true. I don't know if it's a healthy kind of connection. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know that you need your mom. You shouldn't be that closely connected. We're too connected. <laughs> I think he's wrong. All right, I'm going to shut up. Just watch this. And let me express first, <laughs> Mr. Zuckerberg, not to be rude, but you should... Mr. Zuckerberg, Facebook not to be rude, but is. I think you should really kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't that be a great twist? Mr. Zuckerberg, I don't want to be rude, but your address is 1143 Silver Lake, and I am on the way with a weapon. Ooh. Plot, plot twist? Too much? <laughs> it's just a joke. He's not really. But yeah, too much. Tone it down. <laughs> God, I wish I could edit that one out. <laughs> no. No, I didn't think. <laughs> oh! oh! You like that? <laughs> Anti-social network. So that, I think he's wrong about that. I think, I don't know, he's more, he's more, 
He's interested. focusing on the wrong parts. Yeah, he's more interested in sounding smart and looking like and doing all this. Social. You know what I mean? Okay, I think we've seen enough, but maybe not. Because while we may have big friend lists, so mm. friend lists oh, all oh, alone. Oh, oh. So I'm gonna pause it right there on friend list. I just saw an article the other day, man. The 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 amount. The, I'm, I'll post it. I'll show a picture or something. Uh, people are more lonely than ever, right? It's it's amazing. Um, maybe amazing is not the right word. It's it's saddening, it's sobering. Um, you know, we we are right connected, but everybody's everybody's lonely. Everybody feels alone. You know, we, everybody we have. We have such um, a lot of mental health issues, a lot of connect, true connection issues, right? This is what I'm talking about, true, true connection. Not just, you know, messages and this and that and talking about true uh, connection with a human being, you know, um, giving hugs. You know, we don't give we don't give enough hugs these days. It's so important that the physical touch of another human being, right, um, to look into the eyes of another person. We don't even do that, you know. It's so um, it's so rare. But I tell you this: do an eye contact experiment with somebody. Take your partner or your friend and just sit with them for one minute and look into their eyes for one minute. It'll be awkward in the beginning, and then you'll see that it starts to you start to really connect in the heart with that person. All right, let's let me quit. Let me shut up. Let me quit going. keep going. Phones, we sit at home on our and not to be rude, Mr. Zuckerberg, but I do have somebody trailing you and your family. We've taken pictures of you in your window every night. And I don't mean to be rude, Mr. Zuckerberg, but <laughs> I am a dangerous man. And I did pass a background check recently. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just it would be interesting if that was the poem. Just putting a twist on it. Computers <laughs> measuring self-worth by numbers of followers and likes. Likes. Ignoring those who actually love us. Ignoring those that like us. They'd rather write post and talk to someone who might actually hug who us might actually hug us at night. You tell me cuz you tell me cuz Mr. Zuckerberg, are you just a Borg? <laughs> and furthermore, <laughs> my collar be popping. By the way, you know that today this guy is on his phone all day. Bro, <laughs> this fucking guy is hustling so hard on social media. Checking his views. Pause, not true. Uh, I really am even on social media, right? A lot of everything is scheduled out. I try to have, I, I'm lucky enough to have a, a, a team of people that help me, you know, organize and post. I'm, you don't see any selfies from me too much. I, I need to do more. I need to do more social media, actually. So that's a, but you're right. You know, this is what I used to be. You know, that's why I made the video is because I, I used to be so addicted, you know, addicted to the numbers, addicted to the views, addicted to the shares, the likes, man, and, and that, it's empty, it's really empty, you know, when your self-worth is defined by how many likes you get on a, on a post, you know, you upload something, don't get, a, don't get a lot of likes, you delete it, that's, hmm, that's, a, that's, it's not a good life to live, just keep going. There is that irony, but... Yeah, there is that irony of trying to take down social media. I think too. it's like you said, the problem is that he's doing it from like the perspective of like, I'm better. Yeah. I see the problem. So it's, it's like, you. Yeah, and, okay. And We've seen enough. I love this video though. Should I keep watching? I'm going to keep watching. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. I love this video. <laughs> keep watching, bro. This Thank you, man. I love you too, Ethan, man. Keep watching the video, dude. I, first of all, I appreciate you even doing this, um, this reaction video, and I'm doing a reaction to your reaction. Which is a rabbit hole, but thank you. You know, I appreciate you. You know, just just making a video, man, and, and getting the getting the messages out there. So thank you for what you do, bro. Great. <laughs> it's such a classic. Let's keep going. Yeah. Let's meet up face to face. They said, all right. All right. What time do you want to Skype? I guarantee you that Let's conversation never happened. <laughs> that never happened. That is the dumbest. <laughs> what time you want to Skype? Let's meet up face to face. What time you want to Skype? Come on, dude. Why you got a front like that happen? Look at the anguish he's in right now. Ah! <laughs> he's in anguish! I think only because you paused it there, am I in anguish? <laughs> My friend wanted to Skype. He was the friend. 
and start resting in a bunch of SMHs and realize, what about me? Mm. Do I not have the patience to have conversation mm -hmm. without abbreviation? That's what I'm this saying. That's, that's what I'm saying right there where I explain. Uh, I haven't seen this video in a while, but that's the part where I explain, hey, what about me? You know, what about my patience? My using all these abbreviations and me being obsessed and addicted to social. So while this was a piece that I wanted to share with the world, it's also um, a release. You know, this is a catharsis. This is a, 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 this is, this is a, I had to get this off of my chest, you know, off of my heart because it was something that I was, I was dealing with, right? This is the best art, you know, when it comes from the first person. Let's keep it going. Stimulation chats have been reduced to snaps. The news is 140 characters. Videos are six seconds at high speed. And you wonder why ADD is on the rise faster than 4G LTE. But get a load of this. Steady. Get a load of this. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I see so much. <laughs> Why doesn't everybody see what I see? My man, you like my gestures, my man. I see. Ah! I need to watch more of H three H threes. Funny, <laughs> funny guy. You're a funny guy, huh? He looks fly though. Oh, you're a no, funny yeah, guy. Your shirt is too relatable. Too relatable. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just. I wish I had a fat Grateful Dead collar. <laughs> That'd be sick. He showed the attention span of the average adult today <coughs> is one second lower than that of a goldfish. Shut up. I guarantee you a human has more attention span than a goldfish. <laughs> if you're able to test that, Prince EA. I'm going to link that study um, in the goldfish, of the goldfish. Uh, I'll probably put it right here or in the description box just for anybody who's, you know, wondering. I know what kind of Let's keep going. labs you're working in. <laughs> Did you know that by the time a child is... 20 years old, they've wasted 20 years of their life on social media. <laughs> they've literally never looked up from their phone. It's crazy what's going on today. So if you wanted a few people on aquatic animals... You know what's so... F oh. I was like, this reminds me of our tech video we made, but it's literally a parody of this video. Yeah. Congratulations. Let me finish by saying you do have a choice. Yes. But this one, my friends, we cannot auto-correct. We must do it ourselves. Take control or be controlled. Yeah, like Make said. a decision. Me? Casey? No longer do I want to spoil a precious moment by recording it with a phone. All right, I get it. <laughs> yeah. I got it. <coughs> Prince EA? So I don't know. I don't think so. I th <laughs> his. I don't. Maybe I am. Maybe I. Maybe he was ahead of the time. I don't know. I just can't. I can't put it in my head that me and that guy are on the same page on this. You know what I mean? It's the approach. It's the approach. Mm. Ah. Hey. All right, so that's the end of the video. Uh, are we on the same page? I don't know. Maybe. You know, let's talk about it. Um, I'm, down to, I'm down to have a chat, you know. Let me know. Um, I'm easy to connect with. But, but yeah, so thank you for, for, you know, checking out the video. Um, really dope. Really dope. Really dope. Um, great shirt, great hat. Um, you both, thank you so much for, for analyzing it. You know, you guys come from a perspective of, you know, while it's, while it's humorous, it's also, you know, you, you, you keep it real as well. So I appreciate that, man. And there you have it. H3H3. What's up? Um, thank you guys for watching this reaction to a reaction video. And, uh, see you next time. Peace. Wait. Wait. Before we cut. Let's read a couple of comments. Let's read a couple of the comments? Yeah, funny. Okay. Let's do like the top comments. Uh, what do you call a guy who never farts in public, a private tutor? Uh, Prince Electronic Arts. Does Prince EA come with 2000? Uh, worst thing is Prince EA. Okay, the worst thing is the Prince EA. The worst thing about Prince EA is that he pretty much only spreads common sense and people act like he's a higher being and should be elected as president of the world. And not to mention the way his fanboys act when you criticize their idol. Ah, you know, that's the thing, man. It's so simple, you know, and sometimes we miss the simplicity of life. You know, common sense, unfortunately, ain't that common. Mm. You know, it's, uh, I think 
I think love is the answer to every problem we face on this planet. That's what I say. That's what I try to, I try to convey. You know, we don't have to make things overcomplicated. You know, and which is what we do. It's a tendency that, that human beings have done for years, and that we're continuing to do. Um, you know, while we create uh, great technology that makes things easier, is it better? Um, does it create a better, more fulfilling life? I don't know. Um, I'm not here to tell you the answers. I, uh, I only kind of convey my perspective. Do I think that things are better? In many ways they are, but also in many ways we see a lot of mental health issues that have been springing up um, because of the very tools that we create to make life easier. I don't know. Uh, okay, Fulta says, but dude, Prince A is actually making some valid points. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I appreciate that one. Uh, Landon Martin says, I don't really get Ethan's take on this. Seems like he is doing a lot of projecting. I, I, I did see a little bit of that. Um, you know, I don't know if I came off as high. I think that might be something that's maybe my voice, maybe because I'm speaking you know, poetically or in a cadence, yeah. maybe the white. She said the white shirt made me seem like a saint. I just wore a white shirt, bro. <laughs> I wasn't trying to act like JC, Jesus Christ. Um, yeah, yeah. All right. Any more? Uh, I saw one about a butterfly tattoo. Yeah. Okay. So camera just died mid sentence, but I think that about wraps it up. Thank you guys for watching this video. Please subscribe to Ethan H3H3 H3 podcast seems like a cool thing that they are doing um, Thank you for your analysis again. If you guys ever want to chat, let me know. I'm open to it uh, I think that's a wrap guys stay tuned for more videos and we out peace